God for the goodness and love which you've made known to us in creation, in the calling of Israel to be your people, in your words spoken to the prophets, and above all in the word made flesh, Jesus your Son. For in these last days you sent him to be incarnate from the Virgin Mary, to be the Savior and Redeemer of the world. In him you have delivered us from evil, and made us worthy to stand before you. In him you have brought us out of error and the truth, out of sin and to righteousness, and out of death and to life. On the night before he died, trust our Lord Jesus Christ to bread. And when he had given thanks to you, he broke it and he gave it to the disciples and said, Take, hey, eat. This is my body, which is given for you. Do this for the remembrance of me. After supper, he took the cup of wine. When he had given thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink this, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Whenever you drink, do this for the remembrance of me. Therefore, according to his command, O Father, we will remember that we will find his resurrection, we will await his coming in glory. We offer our sacrifice of praise and thanksgiving to you, O Lord of all, presenting to you from your creation this bread and this wine. We pray, gracious God, to send your Holy Spirit upon these things, that they may be the sacrament of the body of Christ and his blood of the new covenant. Unite us to your Son in sacrifice that we may be acceptable to him, being sanctified by the Holy Spirit. In the fullness of time, put all things in subjection under your Christ, and bring us to that heavenly country where with Lewis and Lamar and all of your saints, we may enter the everlasting heritage of your sons and daughters, through Jesus Christ our Lord, the firstborn of all creation, the head of the church, and the author of our salvation. By him and with him and in him, the unity of the Holy Spirit. All honor and glory is yours, Almighty God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. Now, as our Savior Christ has taught us, we are bold to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, and we forgive those who trespass against us. And be us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Alleluia. Christ, our Passover, is sacrificed for us.
stated there are three communion stations, two down front, and there will also be one in the back, both the bread and the wine.